guys welcome back to my channel um it's been a while but i'm back with a really 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 big yes i'll haul for you guys so you know it's like a reward you know um but i have a lot of clothes for you guys it's around like 300 400 worth of clothes um some of it is like mainly clothes and then there's some accessories and then i also am going to show a couple of like makeup products at the end so then make sure to stay tuned for that uh, but without further ado let's just get started before I get started, make sure to use my discount code at YesStyle, B4ZRUU, if you want to get some money off your purchase because there's a lot of great stuff at YesStyle, as you can see from the history of my channel. Um, so definitely, you know, save some money. Alright, we're going to start with tops. So this is our first one. It is like a crop top with like a, I don't know, it just makes my waist look really snatched, so I kind of like this design. And other than that, I think the actual print is also really cute. It's a bit higher on like the neck, but I actually think it looks pretty good. Because usually I complain about it because it makes my neck look short, but I think in this case it actually looks good. Um, and the back also has this thing. Um, but yeah, this is one of the ones I really like and I've already worn it out like quite a bit, so um, highly recommend it. It's like, honestly, the quality is pretty good. Like it feels very soft and everything, not uncomfortable, scratchy or anything. And look at that. It's amazing. I love it. Alright, this is our next one. So this one's pretty soft, um, but like I will say like mine came with the hole here and um, I thought it was a real hole, but it's actually a finger hole, I'm pretty sure, but like it doesn't fit well, I guess. Like it's, I feel like it's too low for a finger hole. Um, and the way I know it's an actual finger hole is because there's one on the opposite side as well. There's no way there'd be like a hole symmetrical, you know? So, I mean, it's like a vibe, but I wish it was a little further up because it's like too much fabric in between these fingers right now, I feel like. But it's a pretty cute design. And like the print here is also pretty cute, so. I also, I think, I don't know. I wish it was a little bit lower on the neck, but other than that, it's also a pretty good length. Slightly cropped, I'd say. And yeah, pretty comfy. So, not bad. All right, this next one I bought like kind of hesitantly because I don't usually wear this kind of clothes, but it's like a see-through mesh um, sort of material and it's very colorful which is why I say I usually don't wear it because I don't wear something that has so many like patterns and colors and prints on it um, but like I think it doesn't look that bad um, I think I, I like this cut like I feel like it's really unique I don't really see tops like this like a triangle um, I will say like I feel like it covers up a little bit too much collarbone on this side, so I maybe wish this part just went lower a bit. Um, and then this like cinchy part here is totally adjustable. So like I tied a knot and then it has this thing. So you can adjust how much this goes up. So you can have it go up all the way here or you can have it pretty low, like all the way down here. Um, all up to preference. And then it is soft. Yeah. And the material isn't like scratchy or anything too. So um, for like a mesh, long sleeve it's actually pretty nice and I think it's pretty cute I actually really like the patterns they have on it and I feel like it kind of works and it's not too like messy or like cloudy all right so this next top is a tube top okay I don't usually wear tube tops but this one's pretty nice it has like a nice elastic here um, and it fits pretty well personally I don't even like tube tops that much but I just bought it because I thought the design was really cute um, but yeah, I have another item that I'm going to show you to pair with this because it works really well. Alrighty, so as you can see, I'm wearing like a like a t-shirt, but it's not a t-shirt. <laughs> so it's like super cropped and it ends like right right above like the chest area. Um, but it hides all like the armpit fat, but it still shows the design of it. I love it because I feel like the reason I don't wear tube tops is because I have like a lot of like fat here and I don't like showing it so I always like having something to cover it um and this thing does exactly that and I you can wear this with like anything like any sort of like tank top camisole I don't know it works it works great if you're just feeling like wanting to cover up a little bit more or like maybe even like if your top is too revealing here so it's amazing I love it all right, this next one I have mixed feelings about. So as you can see, it is like a bit see-through, um, but it's like pretty comfy too. I will say I really like the back. I like how like open it is. 
Um, I like this. I don't know. This is really sexy. But I think the only issue I have with this one is like this cut, I guess. I feel like it's too round. So it makes me look a little broad-shouldered because I already am broad-shouldered and I don't know. Like, it's not making me look as snatched as I could look. It's my only complaint, but other than that, it's great, so. <laughs> okay, our next item is a bodysuit, actually. So um, this is what it looks like. It's really cute and then you can zip it up however much. I don't like zipping it up all the way. I kind of like having a loose thing. Um, and then... It has like a little button on the crotch area, so easy, easy bathroom access, I guess. Um, but yeah, it's actually really comfy and it's really soft, surprisingly, um, which is really nice. And it like fits everything really well. Nothing's like too tight. Um, so I actually highly recommend this. I haven't even worn this yet. I really love it. It's, wow. Wow. Get ready guys, this next one is super sexy. So this one, Rockmore. I buy so many of their stuff. The tube top was also from the Rockmore thing. I love it. Like the material's pretty thin and it's not like, it doesn't feel like a great quality, but like, I mean, it's comfy and it works and it's really cute. Like, I will say it goes like super high up, like the, so like if you wear it in a weird way, like it low-key might give you a wedgie, but like, for the most part, it's been fine for me. I will say the only thing is like sometimes this part goes a little too low and when I wear like my, my strapless bra, sometimes the bra like will show like like this-ish. Um, but then if I pull it up, then it's like wedgie time. So that's like the only bad thing about it, but otherwise it's so cute and I really enjoyed wearing it. I wore it out before, so um, I think it's great. So up to y'all. I like it. Alrighty y'all, I don't even want to spend a lot of time on this top because I... I literally can't figure out how to wear it because there's all these like strings and I have to tie it myself but like once I tied it and I put it on now it's scrunched up like this so um the top itself like it has like it's a padded bra included with it and then that's kind of what it looks like so you can get the vision um I'm just really bad at executing the vision so but the quality is pretty nice and it's really comfy, so like if you can tie it better than I can, it's probably a great top. Okay, now we're moving on to um, like skirts and sweatpants and pants, whatever, stuff like that. So, first one. So this one's pretty cute. I will say it's like kind of like, it sits a little bit low on the waist. It's like not high-waisted, um, which is pretty cute, honestly. Um, and it has like a tie zipper here um, and it's actually really good quality like when you feel it, it's like really firm and it just feels like not that cheap you know um, and it's really cute it's a really cute pleated skirt so I don't know if you can tell the details but I really like it all right this next pair of pants are like the pants I've been wearing religiously the past like week so Okay, so these are like really, really, really baggy, really, really baggy sweatpants, gray sweatpants. Um, and I really like them because one, elastic here with a tie, and second of all, there are like more elastic tie things at the bottom of the pants. So it makes it really adjustable for your height or anything. Um, and because I am someone who's really short and I have short legs, it works great. Because one thing you'll see as a pattern in the next few items is that they're too long for me. So the previous pair of pants, they were pretty thin. These are also thin. These are more like track pants material, I'd say. Yeah, these were also originally too long for me, but I literally, I just cut them with scissors without even hemming them. And it actually looks pretty good. So there's a couple of loose threads, but at the end, but like, all right, this next pair is so cute. So as you can see, these are like kind of have like the Dickies vibes where they have like the little like waistband thing. And I think it looks so good. It like really snatches in the waist. 
Um, and it does have like, an, like a drawstring still here, so it makes the waist adjustable. The only thing for me personally is that they are way too long. Like, there's just so much extra material at the end, so I either have to like hem it or something. So, but that's a me problem. It might fit y'all. So, all right, this next pair is like a really comfy, thicker material sweatpants. So these are really comfy. Like I definitely wear these at home all the time because they're really soft and like the quality is pretty good. So it's like a good kind of soft. And then they also have like the drawstring I was talking about at the bottom here, um, along with elastic here. There's no drawstring, but it's elastic. So it's pretty good, I'd say. So highly recommend this one. Okay, this next one also has a bunch of drawstrings. So. I will say I wish this one was baggier because I feel like it's a little too tight right now. So it doesn't make my hips look that wide. And I usually like that because it makes my waist look more snatched. So besides that, it's a pretty good, good, good pants. Yeah. And it's like pretty thin material, I would say. But the quality actually feels pretty nice. So, all right, this next pair is really cute. Yeah, it's a little bit long, but it does have a drawstring at the end, but it's like interesting because it's like in the middle of the pants instead of like here. So it like kind of works, kind of doesn't, but other than that, I think it's pretty cute. I will say though, they make a lot of noise when you walk around. So if you're like wanting to not make a lot of noise, then maybe don't wear these. <laughs> Okay, one last thing before we move on to some of the beauty products. I bought some accessories and I wanted to show you guys. So one of them are these like leather fingerless gloves. It's sort of fingerless, not really. But I don't know, they're just so interesting. And I feel like they're such a good accessory for like stage performances, like if you're like a dancer. Isn't it? I don't know, I kind of love it. Pop, pop, pop. Anyways. And then next, I got this like garter so garter is like what you wear around your thigh um i haven't tried it on but i just thought i'd show y'all and then i think it also comes pretty much i just bought like i don't even know what this is i'm, I'm not gonna be honest i don't know where this goes but i bought like one of those like body bondage like if you ask me how to wear this i don't know but it, it would look cool as a stage outfit is all I'm saying, so. Point is, I bought them. I don't know how to wear them yet. That's for another day. Now let's move on. <laughs> okay, so the lighting is quite trash here, but we're gonna deal with it. Um, so I wanted to show you guys some new products I got recently that I've been really loving, all from Yastyle, so let's just get started. Okay, so your brand you'll hear constantly here on my channel is Roman, and I actually got another Roman product recently. It is their glass thing water gloss. So this is a lip gloss, not one of their lip tints, but it's in the shade Meteor Track. Um, I have some lip product on right now. This is what it looks like. It's really, really pretty. Um, let's open it up. This is what the applicator looks like. It's kind of like a random rubber spatula looking thing. Mm -hmm. You can kind of see the shine already. It's shiny. It is so shiny. It is even shinier in person. Oh my god. And it's not sticky at all, which is great. It has a slight tingly feeling, to be honest. Maybe it has plumping effect. It smells a little like minty almost, so that could be a thing. Um, but let's move on. Another product I wanted to show y'all. Um, was something that is very very popular nowadays. It is the Clio Kill Cover Mesh Cushion. Um, I got it in the shade 2 Lingerie, um, which I believe is one of their lighter shades. So I'm sorry, the puff just came out, but this is what it looks like. You can see me right there. Um, I really like the puff because it's like pointed, which helps you get in some of the little like nooks and crannies of your face. And then this is like a mesh thing, so when you press it, the product will come out. 
And what I do is I always tap it and then I tap it here to get the excess out and then I put it on my face. Um, and then another product that I've been really, really loving is from Goodall, um, this brand Goodall. And it is their Green Tangerine Vitamin C Eye Gel Patch. So these are just like under eye, almost like sheet masks almost. So it comes like this, comes with like a little spatula, which I think is super cute. And what you do is you open it and then you get all these little gel patches that you just, you know, you just take them out whenever you want to wear them. Put it on your face using the spatula and just let it sit there for like 10, 15 minutes. And it just feels really refreshing. And as someone who like barely gets enough sleep and have really bad dark circles, I really love using it. And then now for the product that I've been most excited to show you guys and try. I've already tried it, but like, I love it. So recently I discovered that Romand has a sister brand that released like, I believe like a couple months ago and it's called News. Um, so N-U-S-E is what it's called. Um, but this is, I bought three of their products. So this one is um, like a, almost like a foundation, I will say. So the whole premise of this brand is that it's like tinted skincare. So it's like makeup, but it's skincare. Um, so this one is in the shade Milky. So this is just to like brighten up your face. Um, I bought this one over like a skin color one because I feel like my skin also looks a little dull sometimes, so I want to brighten it up. Um, another color I would have considered getting was the green one. I forgot what it's called, but I also have redness on my face, so I also considered getting that one. And then another product is this one. I also really like this one. Um, this one is their, like, like a blush, but it's skincare. And this one's in the shade Pink Poke, something like that. I don't really know. But it's really, really pretty. Um, and when you squeeze it out, let me just show you guys. It's like a really pretty color. I don't know if y'all can see that at all. Sort of. It looks a little brown on camera, but it's a really, really pretty color. And it's a really good cool tone color. So, as like a blush. Yeah, I don't know why it looks so brown, but it's, it's definitely pinker. IRL, but it's really, really pretty. I really love it. And then the last thing, as you guys know, Roman is amazing at their lip products. So they came out with another lip product in this um, brand. And this one is in the shade 05. It's called Cool Babe. Um, I've been really enjoying it. So this acts as like almost like a lip oil, lip balm, but not really, but it is skincare. So it does moisturize your lips. This is what the applicator looks like. Just like your typical like lip tint. Um, I don't want to put it over, but let me just swatch it for you guys. Um, the color is going to be a little off, but in general, this is what it looks like. It's definitely a bit more red, I would say, and a little bit more like mauve color. IRL, it looks really dull on camera because my lighting is really bad right now, but it's a really pretty color. I highly suggest you guys check out these products like on the website to get like a better idea of what the color is supposed to look like because my camera is not really capturing it. But I really wanted to show you guys um, this brand and their products because it's been a brand that's been rising up in like popularity recently. So I didn't even know about it until recently too. So I thought it would be nice to let y'all know because you know who doesn't want to wear skincare that's tinted instead of wearing makeup and skincare, I guess. I don't know. Like it's like a two in one. It's great. And I really love them. They've been actually, I, I literally, these are part of my daily makeup routine now, so, yeah. But yeah, if you guys are interested at like Roman products, the Clio, the News, you guys can get them either at the YesStyle website, you can get the Roman products on the Roman website, I have a discount code for Roman as well. And then another place you guys can get them is Olive Young. I might have a code for them, I totally don't remember, but check below, maybe there is. Um, but there's plenty of codes you can find online, you know, just do a little bit of searching. Um, I love using Olive Young, I buy a lot of stuff from Olive Young as well. Um, but yeah, these are all available on your style, so make sure to check that out. Um, and yeah, that's all I have for this haul. Um, that was like $375 worth of stuff. So I'm super happy to be able to show you guys all of it. Um, you know, it's fun for me to try on all these clothes and get to wear them out, see how they are, see how they fit, how they feel, you know. Um, but yeah, I hope that was a nice haul, um, and I hope I'll be able to create more hauls for you guys. I'm kind of busy with school, so they'll come out periodically. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys will come watch my next haul. But for now, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.